Deep drop for Stafford off his play action. There is Robinson on cue. Johnson gave him cushion. And Robinson takes advantage for the gain to the 40-yard line, a pickup of 19. It's his first time here with fans since 2018. Oh, wow. he just flipped it to Parkinson with all that pressure coming. Parkinson gets knocked down by Booker, but it's a first down and more of the elite processing that Mark was talking about. Throw on different platforms, throw off balance, etc. This time he's going to get wrapped up, and the Bears' pass rush finally gets to him. And this is a good start to the season for Jervon Dexter Sr. The perfect start for Cardi continues. He's made all 12 of his field goals and PATs combined. The Rams strike first in Chicago. Tutu Atwell makes the catch. He's got a first down in front of Tyreek Stevenson. And a flag is thrown as the two are jostling out of bounds. Stafford stepping, looking, throwing sideline right into the hands of Jaquan Brisker. It's picked off. It's Chicago ball. Their seventh takeaway already this season. So Cardi comes out for a 37-yarder. And an easy one for him as he continues his perfect start. Let's go Sean McVay with an excellent game called. And Matthew Stafford with yet another comeback victory. Now he goes to work with a 6 0 Oh, lead. that ball is out. And the Bears defense may have come up with a crucial play. When the offense has struggled, the defense has come alive. Montez Sweat knocked it free. Kyler Gordon comes out with it in Rams territory. The mini fridge. Kramer, the fullback. The give to Johnson. And the Bears have tied the game after the takeaway. Well, just some excellent push up front by the offensive line in here. Follow the big guys, follow 79. Hang in there, rookie, won't get those calls yet. <laughs> Second down, Williams shuffling, stepping up, collapsing pocket. That's one thing you can't do. Bears will have to Turn use a timeout. timeout here as Kobe Turner was the first man there. Michael Hoyt helped finish it off. Cairo Santos missed his first field goal of the season last week from 56. Otherwise, he's been excellent. And that continues. Continue with the field goal fest. <laughs> Williams. A really good patient runner. He waits for these holes to develop. Riccardi with his fourth field goal attempt already. And it will make it a one-point game. Rams bring an extra body. Williams protected. Williams to the back of the end zone for DJ Moore and a touchdown. Their first connection together. You get DJ Moore on Roseboom right there, number 56. That's West Coast offensive minds. That stretch play to get it to Kyron Williams, who gets the first down and plenty more until Bayer knocks him out of bounds. Excellent run from Williams to set up first down and goal for Los Angeles. Down by eight to start the fourth. Right to Kyron Williams, and he is into the end zone. A seventh straight game with a touchdown for Kyron Williams. Stretch for that football. And now the tempo again as Swift gets going. Oh, there oh. goes DeAndre Swift for his first Chicago Bears touchdown. Well, watch Coleman Shelton get up to the second level. Same with Braxton Jones. It's right here and right here. And then Cole Komet, again, cutting off the backside. DeAndre Swift does the rest. The Bears sticking to this run game and runs like that. It's Longest attempt of his young NFL career. It's a big one from 52 for Cardi. And he drills it to keep it at a one possession. Taking anything away from the Bears. They had an excellent showing. Their defense showed up when they needed to. Led the league in interceptions last season. They're right on track to be up near the top again this year. But too many mistakes. 
by the Rams. Didn't get help when they needed it on a couple of crucial calls on their quarterback. And the Bears come out on top. What an outing for Caleb Williams. Victory formation at home. They win their second straight home game to get back to 2-2. Two and two. And Matt Eberflus calms the storm in Chicago for the moment.